Here we are at a very special episode of Accidental Apprentice Podcast. I'm your host, Adam Melnick, and today I'm here at the Boys and Girls Club of Oshawa. And uh, what I have today is I have some very important people to talk to us about a very important topic, and that is bullying. We've all seen it. We've all been around it. Maybe we've been part of being bullied, or maybe we've been part of the bullying. Hopefully there's lessons learned. But what we're going to do is we're going to delve into the experts. And we're going to hear from the people that know the situation better than anybody else and who can give us the best ways to move a path forward on a topic that, quite frankly, in 2019, we shouldn't even be talking about anymore. So I have an expert here in front of me, and we're going to get some insights. So let me start with saying hello. Hi. Thanks for joining us today on the podcast. Let's start with this. What would you do if someone tries to bully you? I wouldn't. I would try to stop them. I would try. I would tell a teacher about it. Oh, that's a good move. Tell a teacher about it. And what would you do if you saw a friend being bullied? I would tell a teacher about that and bring them to the situation that's happening. And what happens if you're not at school? Um, if I'm not at school, like if I if say, it happens somewhere else. Yeah. Say you're at a park, and maybe you've you're at a park, maybe at a friend's house. What, what what would you do next? I would get an adult. So you're you're gonna you're gonna pass on that if someone's bullying or being bullied, you're not gonna stand for that, are you? No. No, that's great. I'm glad to hear that. Have you seen anyone be bullied before? Um, I think maybe once or twice. And how did that make you feel? I didn't like it. And and if you were to see it again right now, and you saw someone being bullied right now, what might you say to the, the bullies? I would tell them that it wasn't nice, and I would tell them to stop doing that. And bullying is a lot of different things, isn't it? Mm -hmm. What are some different things that, when people say the word bullying, and I'm using quotes, right? What might be things that would be actions that are bullying? There could be, like, physical bullying, or someone's, like, saying things to you that aren't nice. Oh, wow. And, And physical bullying, that's, like... Pushing. Yeah, or like punching or hitting or something like that. Where do you see bullying happening happening the most? Um, I think it would be like at schools. Like in class? No, not in class, like at recesses. Where there's less teachers and adults around, yeah. right? Okay. And is that really like mean words or is that pushing or do you th- is it really just a bit of everything? It's a bit of everything. Let me ask you this though. Why do you think kids bully other kids? Because sometimes kids just do it for fun, or sometimes kids just do it for reasons like something's happening in their life, or they just want to express their feelings by bullying. Oh, and, and you think that for them to deal with some of their emotions and how they're feeling, that they just take it out on other people? Yeah, sometimes. Oh. If you were feeling sad or upset, or you had feelings that were bothering you, do you think by being mean to others, it's going to make you feel better? No. What would you say to somebody if that had those types of feelings and, and they wanted to deal with them? Would, do you have any ideas that might be better than bullying? They could talk to someone about it or like just talk to their parents about it or like try to um, just talk about it. Get it out, right? Yeah. That's not being a bully. Yeah. Hmm. And it's okay to talk about stuff that sometimes seems a little strange to talk about Mm -hmm. but it's better than doing things that are going to hurt others right yeah do you have any any words of advice to people that have been bullied um that you should try to stand up for yourselves and that if someone's bullying you you should tell the teacher instead of just not doing that and just letting them do it I think you should tell a teacher as soon as it happens or a parent. And if something's happening with you're being bullied and you're around your friends and there's no teacher around, is it okay to tell your friends? Yes. Yeah, absolutely, right? The more people that know and draw attention to it, what happens to the bullying? It stops. It does, doesn't it? And is there a question you would ask a bully if you were being, if someone was being mean to you? Do you have a question or something you'd say to them? I would ask him if they would like it if I did that to them. 
Mm, and what do you think their answers would be? No. Absolutely. No one wants to be bullied. And that's the message here, right? Nobody deserves to be bullied. Mm -hmm. right? You want to say that with me? Nobody deserves to be bullied. Nobody deserves to be bullied. Excellent. Well, listen, I can't thank you enough for your time. And I appreciate you being on the podcast. Thank you. You have a great day. I love you.